All right, y'all. We watching the menu. Let's get it. Let go. Oh, baby girl, let me get a puff. Babe, I'm just joking. Please don't Do not smoke. smoke. Kill your palate. Right. What well, he said. Tonight is huge. Okay. The flavor profiles. It's all super delicate. Oh yeah. When you smoke, you ruin your ability to be able to appreciate it. <laughs> oh, is that right? Yeah. Come on. You don't want. To... Come on. Come on. No smoking. Fine. Come on. This is a friendly channel. Is, is that gonna fit everyone? Easily. Is it gonna fit my fat behind? What are they trying to profit? Twelve fifty ahead. That's how. Twelve fifty ahead. Kidding, right? Oh what heck to the no. Well, that's not ruin this by talking crazy. I just go with the. Oh phone. heck Let no. It magical. Let it be magical. Let it be magical. Bro, my boy, my boy. Ain't nobody got money to be doing twelve fifty ahead. Uh uh. <laughs> you get twelve dollars and fifty cent. <laughs> <laughs> no twelve fifty out of me. <laughs> yo, yo, f hold up, go back, go back, Joe, Joe Biden. I know that ain't you. Hi guys. Joe, Joe, what you doing in this movie, bro? <laughs> what you doing in this movie, bro? The president of the. I'm done. Who's that Hillary Clinton right behind him? Lillian Bloom. Oh my God. Who's Lillian Bush? Just food crate. <laughs> so my what? next baby mama. All aboard for Hawthorne. Hawthorne, all aboard. <laughs> Don't mind if I do, but not for no 1250 ahead. <laughs> Oh, oh, jokes. It was a violent night. Oh, yeah, well, hey, if you haven't seen that reaction, go check it out. Oh, yeah, old girl kind of fine that she that's walking with him. Make sure people don't bother me. God, we both know you were not bothered. I saw all his movies when I was a kid. Hey, listen. Apparently, he's forget his movies. His shorty is fine. Chef <laughs> That polka dot dress on. locomotion with lemon caviar. This is this is what. Whoa, 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 whoa. Time out. Time out. Time out. Time out. Time out. Time out, time out, time out. With lemon caviar. A oyster with lemon caviar. This is what's making this 1250 ahead. This crap right here, with all the suds in it. I don't like suds in my food. <laughs> and an oyster leaf. Are you freaking kidding me? 1250 ahead for this? I swear, if I was on that boat, I'd been like, huh. that's $12.50, right? Here you go. I don't even think I got $12.50 on me. Let me see. Let me see. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me pay for, let me pay for the food. Got $5. <laughs> okay, I got more than 15 but still. Lemon pearls are made with alginate. Alginate. I know my boy ain't food. taking a picture That's for an Instagram. I'm, bro, right. I'm done. Yeah. You know that junk nasty. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> it's, it's disgusting, huh? It's laughable. <laughs> this is nasty, huh? Fucking laughably good. Mm -hmm. It's good. You lying. Mm -hmm. Think it's the balance of the products. You need the mouthfeel of the mignonette. Please don't say mouthfeel. Right. Mouth feel. Pause. Pause. Yo, whoever was in the studio? <laughs> Y'all better tear it up. You hear the violins? Jesus, this is like prom. Yeah, I never went to prom. Really? Why not? Because none of the cool girls like you said yes. Oh, oh he had no riz. Fuck those bitches. <laughs> oh, okay. Hello, Felicity Lynn. Hello, how you doing? And Damien Garcia. And Micah Stewart. Mr. D, Mr. Ludford, and Miss Westerville. Uh, oh, no, um, sorry, yeah, no, that was, uh, it's not Miss What the change change of plans, so Miss Westervelt can this is Miss I'm Marco. Hi. Nice to meet you. <clears throat> nice to meet you too. Margo. Welcome. You better show that shade. <laughs> you better show that shade. I'm so sorry. That was really awkward. I'm sorry. Yeah. That was not No, no. Fine. Don't worry about it. <laughs> sorry. I'm gonna let you know right now that was not all right. <laughs> Please follow me. <laughs> I sure will. I'm moving into the presenter phase of my career. Nobody give a crap about your presenter phase. <laughs> we have 
the bounty of the sea surrounding us. Okay. Out there right now, we are harvesting scallops. You'll eat them tonight. No, get out. Oh, oh, get shit. out of here. Hey. Oh. I'm still not paying hey, 1250 but I, listen, I'll, I'll take it. Yeah, give me a double cheeseburger while you're out there, too. <laughs> okay, Mr. Krabs. Our smokehouse is in the Nordic tradition. We use the meat of dairy cows only. Okay. Which we age for an astonishing 152 days to relax the protein strands. Oof. Okay. So what happens if you serve it on the 153rd day? Does all hell break loose? Or? Well, I suppose the bacteria would introduce itself to the consumer's bloodstream and spread into their spinal membranes, after which point he or she would become incapacitated and shortly thereafter expire. So yes, all hell would break loose. <laughs> so I'm not eating the food. <laughs> like, Good thing we're pros, yes? Uh, I, there's a lot of cons I hear. <laughs> this is where we live. Okay. Yeah. Kind of nice up in here. All right. Live here, all of you. I like what y'all got all going on up in here. Except chef. Yeah, well. Are those the toilets? <laughs> no, Mr. Feldman. Yo, we got a poop Very and pee in front of each other? Here we are family. Each day starts at six with five hours of prep work. We harvest, we ferment, we slaughter, we marinate, we liquefy, we spherify, mm -hmm. we gel. Yeah, we gel. We gel. Dinner is typically four hours and 25 minutes. Each day ends at well past two in the morning. So yes, it's best that we all live here. Because we're not we're not gonna slide past that like you like you is. Don't be yelling at me, sis. <laughs> I'm just trying to figure out what the heck is going on. You talking about we gel? What the heck we gel? Who's we? <laughs> like other than we, but who's we? <laughs> like we gel. God. Let's go. Now, who's hungry? I am. Shoot, you're talking too much. Elsa, hi. Uh, who lives there? Chef. Oh, can we see that? Even we are not allowed inside Chef's cottage, Mr. Lefford. Red flag. Red flag. Y'all ain't invited in there? Red flag number one. I'm just saying. I mean, technically, red flag number two. But I'm going to just I'm gonna keep that as number one. Y'all not invited or y'all can't go in there? I don't know, but it but it's out here. Red flag. Oh, y'all got a whole staff. Y'all got a staff staff. Oh, y'all got money. Okay. Don't tell me that's what we eat. I'm never coming back here again. If that's the case. Joe Biden. Switch seats with me. That, no mind if I do, sir. Mills, you will be sitting in Miss Westervelt seat. You should have a better view. Well, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't need a She is throwing all the shade. Feel free to observe the cooks as they innovate. I sure, but I sure please will. do not photograph our dishes. Chef strongly feels that the beauty in his creations lies in their ephemeral nature. Here, come on, we can't miss this. Oh. I, I, I'm sorry, I just need, I need a picture. <laughs> Do you make a Paco Jet can produce a powderized uh, snow-like texture? Cool. You really know your stuff, Mr. Ledford. You know my name. All we like to know, everyone who dines with us. And, and Chef, is he around here somewhere? I'd love to talk with Why don't you take him. your seat? We're about to serve. Red flag yeah, number two. Yeah, okay, thank you. Red flag number two. Uh-uh. You know my name, and as soon as I mention the chef, oh, you need to sit down. <laughs> Y'all, some fishy, some fishy, but it's too early to say. But some's fishy. If you peep it, if you know, you know. See us, we here. We we could peep stuff early. If you a store family member, you could we could peep this stuff. There's something weird going on. I we gonna find out. He knew my name, bit. Yeah, I noticed you didn't ask his name. That long enough. Right. I would have asked everybody's name. What's your name? What's your name? What is your name? Uh uh, not this music. See, uh uh, I don't like that. They did that to put some snow on top of some gummies? I'm not, bro. Bro, we are never coming back here again. We have a compressed and pickled cucumber melon, milk snow, and charred lace. Enjoy. A mousse boucher? 
Bougie, aka. Like to say thank you for the last two years. This opportunity has been uh, the best of your life, and let's have too many, many, many more. Trying to do a goodbye toast. Can you please just let me do that? No, it ain't. No, it ain't. Yes, it is. I'm starting. Oh my God. I told you this two weeks ago. Oh no. Here's my work phone. Here's the production what are you company doing? credit card. Non transferable. And here is the key to your house in LA, your apartment no in New York, and your other apartment in New York that your wife doesn't is know. Is she breaking up with you? Oh, snap. <laughs> You're doing this. You know, man, they're not good. It's not good. Is your fault? No, it was her fault. She made me text her co worker. Yeah, fucking, of course it's my fault, bro. I'm an asshole. Well, I'm saying, yeah. we're at work. And money. Work. The work and money. Yeah, baby. Mm -hmm. Yeah, baby. Yeah, baby. Oh, my. So, what is it with this food thing? I don't right. know. It's like, you know how people idolize, you know, athletes and musicians and painters and stuff. Mm -hmm. Yeah, those people are idiots. What they do, it doesn't matter. They play with inflatable balls and ukuleles and shit. Chefs, they play with the raw materials of life itself, and death itself. It's. I mean, I've watched every fucking episode of Chef's Table two or three times. I've watched Slow Ex twenty times. I've watched him explain the exact moment the green strawberry is perfectly unripe. I've watched him play a raw scallop during its last dying contraction. The muscle, it's art on the edge of the abyss, which is where God works, too. It's the same. That was beautifully put, Tyler. Stop. Beautifully no, put? What the heck is he talking about? <laughs> First course. Okay, well, I'm, I'm curious. It's nasty, ain't it? Why look like he was drinking pee? Okay. Yeah, chef. Just okay. Um. Good evening. Good, Good evening, evening to you too. Over the next few hours, you will ingest fat, salt, sugar, protein, bacteria, fungi, uh -uh. various plants and animals, uh -uh. and at times entire ecosystems. But I have to beg of you one thing. It's just one. Do not eat. Is he serious? Taste. Savor. Relish. Consider every morsel that you place inside your mouth. The heck is my boy talking about? I can't eat. I came all this way for $12.50 a head to savor my food. My boy, I'm about to eat all this food. Are you freaking kidding me for $12.50? I'm eating all this food. I I want seconds. Bring out the next plate. Twelve fifty. Do y'all understand? If I'm paying twelve fifty for this whole experience, I'm eating every single thing and I'm cleaning the plate. And what I mean by clean the plate, I mean I'm I'm licking that junk clean, so they don't have no dishes to do. Twelve fifty ahead, and you gotta savor your food. Don't eat. Man, couldn't be me. Our first course is called the island. On your plate are plants from around the island placed on rocks from the shore, covered in barely frozen filtered seawater, which will flavor the dish as it melts. Now here's what you must remember about this dish. We, the people on this island, are not important. The island and the nutrients it provides exist in their most perfect state without us gathering them or manipulating them or digesting them. What happens inside this room is meaningless compared to what happens outside, in nature, in the soil and the water and the air. We are but a frightened nanosecond. Nature is timeless. The heck is he talking? Enjoy. What the heck is he talking about? But my, my boys, it sums off. Something is off. I'm sorry. It is all the way off. I, bruh. Whatever happens in here is meaningless, but what happens out there is nah, nah, because it's very much meaningful in here with 12.50 ahead. You know, the nicest restaurant in my hometown. You don't is think that? Chef's mad at me, right? For the scallop thing? You don't have to call him Chef Tyler. I'm pretty sure he doesn't even know about your existence. I, I kind of want him to. Like you? <laughs> yeah, kind of. Tyler, you're the customer. You're paying him to serve you. It doesn't really matter whether he likes you or not. God, I know my boy ain't crying. <laughs>
I know my boy is not crying. First of all, y'all, I got me some Mac. I got me McFlurry and some cookies. This. <laughs> like, if they were serving stuff like this and they told me I had to savor it, could be me. That's what I'm trying to tell y'all. <laughs> Could be him movie. From our friends at Caroline Barre, a Chassagne Montreche, Premier Crew from 2014. Well, that's that good cool thing. Thoughts? I'm really feeling this is quite. It's half great. It's there in moments. There in moments. There's a neediness to the plating, you know? I mean, it's been tweezered to fuck, but. The Sounds like there's no season there. there. It's very clean. It's very, um. Thalassic. Thalassic? Oceanic Thalassa was the primeval spirit of the sea. Thalassa so. and Pontos. Yes, 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 So, yes, yes. so seafood? <laughs> Fishy? <laughs> we're eating the ocean. We're eating the ocean. Yeah. Yes. Now we're eating the ocean. Bro, y'all, y'all, give me all this movie. How oh, is it? You like this? The outer food? Yeah. yeah, it's solid. I mean, I've had shellfish just as good. I like this McDonald's food, too. Y'all, you know, okay. I'm sorry to pause it randomly. So I'm just not getting a good vibe. I don't like the way Shorty's walking around looking at everybody. I, I don't I don't know. I don't know. Something not sitting right with me, y'all. I don't know what it is, but it's it's just not sitting right. Maybe we'll find out. But it don't look good. Some some people saying it sound it's it sound. Some people are saying it tastes fishy. She's talking about some Delancic or whatever the heck she said. Oceanic fishy. The other person talking about something else. My boy is crying. I, I, let's go. Thank you. Not him snatching off her plate. I want plating in five. Yes, sir. Uh huh. Cause like the army. <laughs> the heck is that? <laughs> My boy, clap like that again. I'm gonna punch you in your right. doggone face has existed in some form for over 12,000 years, especially amongst the poor. Flour and water, what could be simpler? Even today, grain represents 65% of all agriculture. So my boy, Fruit you gonna do this every single time you bring out a course? You gonna, you gonna talk? Greek, and how did Jesus teach us to pray if not to beg for our daily bread? I know he did not just bring up my boy Jesus. Food of the common man. But you, my dear guests, are not the common You leave my boy Jesus out of this. <laughs> Hold up. Y'all yeah, read that, right? Y'all can read, right? Twelve fifty ahead for these little dots on a plate for some breadless bread plate. I'd rather eat this breadless bread plate. Twelve fifty ahead. It's that white people stuff. Uh-uh. I don't know. The shit around the total absence of the bread is like really good. I mean, it's a like, little outrageous, isn't it? Not a little. It's yeah. just outrageous. Though I will say that this emulsion does look slightly split. Emulsion? Bro, it's sauce. <laughs> I'm getting sick of these words, y'all. <laughs> it's a concept. I know what a concept is, Tyler. Trust me, he's telling a story. That's what makes his food so exciting. He's not just a chef, he's a he's a storyteller. And he doesn't give a fuck about the rules. Call me the girl next door, but maybe there are some rules that you should give a fuck about. Like, I don't know. Y'all, I'm gonna tell you right now, this is just me. I can't speak for y'all, but this is for me. I don't give a crap about a story when it comes down to food. I don't give a crap. <laughs> I don't give a crap. Give me my dog on food. I don't want. I don't. I don't need all this extra history and oh, this is how. No, 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 no. no. Just give me my food. Oh, he's a storyteller. No, he's a chef. Make some food. It, it, this ain't no book. This not a book. <laughs> like, I'm done. I'm sorry. Miss <clears throat> Bloom, mm -hmm. here is another broken emotion. 
Well, like egg yolks. <laughs> Excuse me, could we please get a little bread, you know, and some gluten free for my friend as well? No. 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 <laughs> okay. yeah. I know she is. All <laughs> I know you need to tell me no, and I paid twelve fifty for this this, 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 uh, this head. Twelve fifty? Do you call me no? <laughs> Let this house gonna go. Either you're gonna give me a piece of bread, or I'm a clunky with this thing I. <laughs> You know who we are. I know who you are. Mm -hmm. Micah still reacts. You know we work <laughs> Thank you. Barrick, right? You will eat less than you desire and more than you deserve. It's a pleasure to serve you. I remain in ketosis, so that's good news. Without the bread in it, uh, focus is right. Something's it's off, y'all. Something's off. Bomb, yeah. This is great stuff. All right. Good. Good. This is great stuff. <laughs> That was a total accident. I did. I, he did it. My boy did it. He broke it. You haven't touched your food. There, there is no food. No, no. This is food. This, 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 this so, would, um, this would be me. It'd be like, more there is no food. Come. The menu only makes sense if you eat. But you told us not to eat. That is not what I meant, madam. You know it. You sure? Well, thank you. For your concern, but I am perfectly capable of deciding when I eat and what. And that's on period. Perfect in three, my friends. Uh uh. Yes, sir. Uh uh. I don't like that. 2013 Pinot Noir from Ross Cobb. We hyper decanted it with an immersion blender to awaken it from its slumber. <laughs> Slavonian oak, <clears throat> cherry and tobacco notes, and a, a faint sense of longing and regret. How many courses they got? Because this is this is wild. Oh, I'm sorry. I want a bite. She's staring again. Well, How do we know her? Next course is called memory, and that is what is meant. To I'm about to slap him in his freaking face. Quit the click the. I can't even speak. Quit the clapping. I'm trying to eat. I can't do this every single time I turn around and I'm trying to enjoy my food. This dish is going to be called I Don't Care. So I'm trying to tell a story. I'm trying to eat. Bring out the food. 1250 ahead. I'm about to punch him in his face. <laughs> when I was growing up, a child in Waterloo, Iowa, Tuesday was taco night. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Taco Tuesday. <laughs> <laughs> and when I was seven years old, one Tuesday, my father came home quite drunk. Really drunk. Also not unusual. My mother grew angry and screamed at him, at which point he proceeded to wrap a telephone cord around her neck and pull it tight. I wept, I screamed, and begged him to stop. To make him stop, I finally had to stab him in the thigh with kitchen scissors. You remember that, Mother, don't you? Well, I suppose I should have stabbed him in the throat that evening. But we're not so smart when we're young. Well, it was, as you can imagine, as a I'm, very I'm smart now. Don't, don't, <laughs> don't try nothing. Oh, thank God he didn't. What the fuck was that? Right! I don't need this story! Give me my food! What makes him a chef artist? My backstory is what makes a chef artist. I'm gonna slap some of these people. So, don't touch my here shoulder. you have house-smoked breast chicken thigh, al pastor, and our own tortillas made with heirloom mast. One of Hawthorne's signature dishes. We change yo, our menu. Yo, so smoke. Yo, yo, so, yo, here yo, you have yo. Y'all, y'all, why is there scissors in my chicken? <laughs> Comment down below if you ever had scissors in your chicken. Now, don't get me wrong. That smoked chicken right there looks so good. I know y'all can't see it because of the, 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 
the thing, the pop up ad in the way. But look at it, look at it. Breast chicken. That thing look good. That thing look good. You put a nasty germy pair of scissors between my chicken. Do you understand the 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 Do you understand the amount of stabbing I would be doing to somebody if someone ever brought this out to me at a restaurant? You put scissors in my chicken. I'm about to take these scissors out and set them so far down your throat. The images on the tortillas have been made using a laser engraving machine. It's the first time we've used it. Red flag. You used a machine on my food and it's the first time y'all used it. Another red flag. <laughs> y'all. I'm not going to this restaurant. If I was there, this would have been my last night. I'm like, uh-uh. <laughs> I am not coming back here again for twelve fifty a freaking twelve fifty a head for this crap. Y'all comment down below if you if y'all eat here. I'm, I'm sorry. I keep let's go. What are they? Well, they're restaurants. Um, that I reviewed that all closed. Richard, what are these? Taco things for the tacos. No, the pictures, they're, they're all of us. Oh. Well, the, this one is after you had the melanoma removed from your forehead. There's the bandage. Isn't that nice? They remembered us. Tyler, is that you? Yeah, they're on me from tonight taking fucking photos. <gasps> yeah. Jesus Christ, what's what? Oh, the <laughs> What? These aren't weird at all. Sunshine. Oh my God, I forgot. <laughs> Dumb part of bad skin. Now, I'm not gonna lie. Hmm. Maybe it's a joke. I'm not gonna lie. Your friends, right? I wouldn't mind my yeah, face yeah. on a tortilla. <laughs> that far, I wouldn't mind. I mean, you know, 12 dollars ahead, I better have my face on a tortilla. <laughs> like. Wait, um. Guys, what the fuck? Are these? How did he get these? What the freak? Not good. Uh, excuse me. Are those bank statements? Can I help you, sir? <clears throat> yeah, what, what the hell are these? These are tortillas. Tortillas deliciosas. Yeah, so what, what are these? These are tortillas, which contain echo Ma'am, what are... It's another document showing how your company has created invoices with fake charges. Ooh! <laughs> how did you get these? I'm sorry, but Chef never reveals his recipes. Ooh! Do you know how fucked you are? I'm gonna have this place close by the morning, do you understand? Oh, no, that won't be necessary. Enjoy. And this is you. <laughs> Yo. Who is that woman? Uh, Joe! Joe, you out here freaking cheating? Well, how the hell should I know? It's fate. It's some sort of. Sort of just, <laughs> Joe out here clapping Tiana Trump. <laughs> I can't. <laughs> Bro, what? <laughs> you know, let's go. If they turn us, then they'd be turning back again. Yeah. And then they'd be just as fucked as we are, right? So we're fine. Right? Yeah, all right. Yeah, we're, we're fine. fine. Yeah, we're fine. Yeah, fine. yeah fuck it. I can't yeah. take your photograph without your consent. Yeah, we're fine. Excuse me, sir. Hi. Did you just fucking snap at me? Dude, I've been trying to get a reservation. Don't be snapping at me. And I don't. Not send shit back to this kitchen, you child. You thank them for even letting you in the door. What did you just call me? I called you a child. What you're fucking acting like. Tyler, you need to apologize to me right now. You cannot speak to me that way. Actually, I can because ding dong, I'm the one who's paying. So maybe shut up and eat. Oh, oh my god. Hmm. Not shut up and eat. Not shut up and eat. Miss Mills, how can I assist you? Just looking for the ladies' room. Right this way. Thank you. What's behind that silver door? Something very special. Lord?
No, you can't. You shouldn't be in here. I'd like to know specifically what it was about the last course that you did not enjoy. You've barely eaten the food. Why? I need to know. Why don't you eat? Why do you care? I take my work very seriously and you're not eating. Red flag. Black flag. Why are you in the ladies' bathroom? Trying to find out why she didn't eat the food. Well, who are you? I'll ask again. Who are you? I'm Margot Mills. So where are you from, Margot? I'm from Grand Island, Nebraska. Now, does that make you feel better? You want the address for my mom's trailer park, you asshole? No, it's not who you want me to think you are. Who are you? I am Margot. You shouldn't be here tonight. Another red flag. He said you shouldn't be here tonight. Why? What is going on? Bro. <laughs> Y'all, there's some twisted, sadistic, <laughs> weird stuff going on here. I just, something weird going on. Let's find out. I'm excited. We're ready for our next course. I'm living. I'm about to punch you in the... Ladies and gentlemen, please meet sous chef Jeremy Loudon. Jeremy created the next dish. It's called The Mess. Jeremy is talented. He's good, but he's not great. He'll never be great. <laughs> now, that was me. I could be Jeremy. That was me. I went like this. I went from this. So, <laughs> Cause we not doing that. I'll never be great. You'll never be a freaking storyteller, you chef. <laughs> he desperately wants my prestige, my job, my talent. Nobody he cares about your job. Things, but he'll never achieve it. I will. Correct, Jeremy. Yes, chef. Man, like me like at his age, Jeremy. Do you like this life? This life that you dreamed about? No, Chef. Mm -hmm. And do you want my life? Not my position and my talent. My life. No, Chef. Oh, don't kiss me. <laughs> Oh, Ladies and gentlemen, your fourth course, sous chef Jeremy's The Mess. Oh! oh! What the fuck? Is this real? What the what heck? Oh, nah. No. I told y'all. I told y'all when we was 10 minutes in. Something weird. Something's going on. That man just shot himself. He's dead. So this is just theater. What the fuck right? are you talking about, lady? He just fucking shot himself. Okay. It, it looked very real and quite real. This is this is just. Daily yeah, reminder to drink some water. This is it... Eat. Uh uh. Listen, I'm. Uh -uh. Enjoy. Nope. I don't like this. I don't like this. Fifth course bit. on order. Yes, sir. I don't How like this. What the hell is going on? And here we have a biodynamic Cabernet Franc from our friends at Domaine Breton. My boy, I don't give a freak about this wine. If you don't get the freak out of my face, <laughs> I'm about to punch him. <laughs> Yo, somebody just shot themselves. You see, he talking about the wine. I bro, I could not. It, I would have been snuffing people to get out of there. I, <laughs> if you get the freak of my, <laughs> ain't no way, ain't y'all, ain't, no <laughs> ain't no way. Can't be me. It could be me, y'all. <laughs> I'm 
I'm sorry. This could not be me. Absolutely not. No added sulfites, uh, a bit of barnyard funk, and just a wonderful yeah, match yeah, with yeah, roasted I, I don't We're give up. No. Oh, I have, have to get my rat. Forget your rat. Get up. <laughs> right. To leave rat? We're leaving. Is something wrong? We're leaving. Right. Joe Biden there is, is not. There is no boat to leave on. Then I'll call a helicopter. That would be very difficult <laughs> to get the service. Joe Biden got money. Do what they say. No, I can, I can, I can not I'll, do what I'll they say. Just, just with which handle. hand, Mr. Liebrand? What? With which hand will you handle this, left or right? What the fuck are you saying? Shall we choose? Choose what? Very well, left hand. Mr. Liebrand, please hold still. Oh! 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 oh. 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 Captain, go talk to him because you know him, right? I made that up. This is one of my why? Favorite because I'm, I'm a name dropping whore, that's why, okay? <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Y'all. The heck am I watching? <laughs> this man shot himself. This man got his ring finger cut off. Then you got that, that dude. Across from Margo, eating food like ain't nothing going on. What the heck am I watching, y'all? <laughs> what am I watching? <laughs> Let's go. I honestly think that this whole thing is just for our benefit. I mean us. What the freak are you talking about? What are you talking about? What are you talking about? I think the whole thing is for our benefit, just us. What are you talking about? What, what, are, you, what, are, you, what are you talking about right now? <laughs> like, what could you possibly be talking about? What benefit do you see in this very scenario? Please tell me. Cause it's screaming black flags. Forget red flags. It's screaming black flags. It's a benefit for us. Just us, just I think it's gonna be just a benefit just for us. This food is very oceanic. The freak are you talking about? Like, let's go. The acting is astonishing. What the fuck are you talking about? Right! Chef the Chef acting Chef is astonishing. Chef I'm about to punch some of these people in the face. This ain't no acting. No, <laughs> Joe, Joe, Joe. <laughs> Joe, it's gonna be all right. It's gonna be all right, Joe. You're just simply wrong. What are you talking about? Who are you? Margo. My name is Margo. I've served many Margos. You're not a Margo. No. What the fuck does it matter? It matters because this menu, this guest list, this entire evening has been painstakingly planned, and you are not a part of that plan. In order to proceed, I have to know where to seat you. With us, or with them. It's really, it's very important. And then you'll let me live? That you live? No. Of course not. Can't you see that? And that'd ruin the menu. We're all gonna die tonight. Isn't that right? Yes, sir! So oh, heck no. Oh, heck. Oh, heck. Heck. Oh, heck. No. Heck no. This restaurant is getting a negative five stars, number one. Number two, I'm picking up the nearest knife, stabbing him in the eyeball. I'm fighting all y'all, one one versus all. We're all fighting. I'm killing all y'all. If, if we're gonna die, we might as well just skip right to it. <laughs> it's a fight to the death then. I'm Y'all, what the heck am I watching? Yes, Chef! I'm gonna slap all y'all! What are y'all under some coat? Let's go. The question is, do you want to die with those who give or with those who take? But I die either way. It's arbitrary. It's not arbitrary. Nothing in this kitchen is arbitrary. Yes, it's everything in that kitchen is arbitrary. Please pick. I'm, I'm stabbing everybody. I'm stabbing. Waiting in five. Every... Yes, Chef! I'm stabbing. I love you all. We love you too, Chef! 
Oh, heck no. Nah. 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 <laughs> Y'all, nah. <laughs> Y'all are lying to me right now. Y'all are lying about this. This is a lie. <laughs> this is a lie straight from the pit. What the freak am I watching? Let's go. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Let's go. Did you offer you a kitchen course? Right, what was it? Protein or veg? Right! Shut the freak up! Protein. Oh, Lord. I'm not eating nothing else. Right, the door is guarded, but you can be a play. <laughs> My man Joe. My man Joe is going through it. Fuck it. I'm going to break the fucking window. Get off me! Coming up like, oh, please, let me help you put this back. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry. I'm done. Let's go. Fuck. There's a saying. Sometimes all you need is a good cup of tea. I learned that growing up in Bratislava. I found that not only does tea cleanse the palate, but it offers a soothing balm when facing some hard home truths. <clears throat> Chef? Yes. Uh, I, I think I speak for everybody here when I say that uh, I want to know. I mean, we, we want to know. What the fuck is this happening, man? Well, I'll tell you. Think of yourselves as ingredients in a degustation concept. What? A tasting concept. Miss Bloom, Lillian, if I may, my cherished early advocate, knows the damage she has done to so many livelihoods. No, 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 no. no. Ha hang no. on. Chef. No. Chef. no, no, no. No, you don't talk. I'm sorry, Chef. You submitted to an interview with what? Lillian Bloom. What? And that you interview her, created Phil. this restaurant. You enable her, Phil. You buttress. You coddle. More broken emulsion, madam. You love that I texted you an invitation for this evening. Me yearning for your attendance. <laughs> Your ego was fed, but that is to be expected. And no, you fed my ego as well, my loyal regulars. How many times have you eaten here in the last five years? I don't know, six or seven. I think it's more than that, Dick. Eleven. <laughs> Eleven times. Most people consider hey, themselves fat. blessed if they eat here only once. <clears throat> Mr. Liebrand, kindly name one dish you ate the last time you were here. Eleven times you take the boat out here where we introduce every dish, every single time. We tell you exactly what we're feeding you. Please tell me one dish you ate the last time you were here. Or the time before. One. Please. God. What? Cod. Cod? It wasn't cod, you donkey. It was halibut. Rare fucking spotted halibut. <laughs> Yo, y'all are done. Y'all are done. She's in there. God. What? God. God? <laughs> no, you donkey. <laughs> Bro, I, I can't. I cannot. And I've been fooled in trying to satisfy people who can never be satisfied. Starting with her, but that's our culture, isn't it? And my restaurant is part of the problem. You say it's your restaurant, but if we're all just being honest tonight, 
It's not. You're right. Doug Verrick is my angel investor. He owns this island and this restaurant. And since Hawthorne is my entire life, I would have to say that Doug Verrick owns me, except now things are a little more complicated, and I own Doug Verrick. Oh my God. <laughs> Holy okay. shit. Hey, hey, how do we stop this, man? No. Okay? Just please just make it stop. Just just fucking tell us how to stop this. We'll stop it, okay? You can't stop Obviously, it. Obviously we have money. Just say how much and we'll give it to you. Just say a fucking number, man! No. I don't need your money. Fallen angel, please. No. Do you hear? Under he goes, ah, quiet. Do you hear it? Do you hear that silence? Listen, can you hear it? That silence means I'm free. He's crazy. What the freak is going on? Nah. <clears throat> All right, all right, yeah, listen. <clears throat> so, I get it, sir, you're angry, or whatever you might be feeling. Maybe you're in a cold, maybe you're just crazy. Maybe you're free, like you said. Here's what's gonna happen. <laughs> like, here's exactly what's gonna happen, because you done showed us enough, and we don't need to keep extending this longer than it needs to be. I mean, what's the point of making this a uh, one hour and 47 minute movie? I'm going to get your best knife. You get your best knife. <laughs> We're both going to have knives. Everybody gets a knife. Let's fight to the death. Let the best man win and walk out of here alive. Let, let, let's just let's just get let's just get on with it. Like, let's just get on with it. If we're all going to die, like he said, that he let's just get to the chase. Let's get to the chase. <laughs> like, why wait? Why extend this thing that much further? Everybody get a weapon. And let's brawl the thing out. Let's brawl it all out. F this food. This food ain't even that good. Let's just let's just fight. <laughs> Chef will speak with you now in his office. My office. This is a kitchen. In a restaurant. Oh, he has an office. He has an actual office. Come in. <laughs> I'm gonna shut my mouth then. Go ahead, office. I'm like, what you want? <laughs> I'm like, oh, if you don't back up. You were right. I shouldn't be here. You belong here. With your own breed. Everyone so down. Ladies and gentlemen, for our next course, let us take the evening air. Come on, outside. First of all, Shorty... Number one. This is number one. Number one, Shorty had him in the room all by himself. I'm choking this mug. I'm choking this mug. Ow. We, we're not doing this. We're not doing this. I'm choking him out. You already done told us we all gonna die. I'm choking you out. Let's, let's get, let's get on with it. I'm choking you out. <laughs> or I'm using you as a hostage. All right. So I have the ringleader here. <laughs> the chef. Now what you're all gonna do is let everybody out here very slowly and nicely. And you're gonna get us a boat, a helicopter, a teleporter, whatever you got to do to get us out of here. And you're going to get us out of here. Or somebody's getting stabbed from the whole staff. Starting with the chef. Everybody going to get it. So either y'all let us go or we all about to fight. Like, I'm not playing this game. <laughs> like, we're not playing these games. She had him in the room all by himself and you just sitting there sitting down in a chair talking to him comfortably and he just told you y'all gonna die? Oh, heck no. Could not be me. Could not be me. You just told me to my face I'm gonna die? Nah. Couldn't be me. I'm just saying. Oh! And then y'all about to go outside. Best believe I'm pushing him into the nearest rock so he can bust his face open and all the blood spills out and I'm making a run for it. Y'all ain't all gonna catch me. I'm 
I'm running as fast as I possibly can. I'm running for my life. If I if I must say so myself. Y'all yeah, not going to catch me. If I'm running for my life, <laughs> you're not catching me. None of y'all are. I'm going to be running until I can't run no more. You're not catching me. If I got to swim home, I will swim home. Are you... Let's go. Don't be frightened. Nothing to be frightened of. Nothing to be frightened of. I'm snuffing everybody. Ted. It's okay. No, we're going to die today. Yes. <laughs> Our next <laughs> Catherine Keller. Three years ago, Julian Sloag tried to fuck me. I refused his advances. A week later, he tried again. And again, I refused. But he didn't fire me. No. He kept me in his kitchen and refused to look me in the eye or... Lady, you seem like a nice person. I'm not even going to yeah, you seem like a very, very, very nice woman. Even considering homeboy tried to push up on you and you refused multiple times. You're very nice. But I don't give a crap about your story. Get me the freak out of here. Ain't no way. Ain't. <laughs> I'm punching somebody. Ain't no way I'm about to just be sitting here listening to y'all stories about this food. And y'all about to kill us. I'm snuffing somebody. I'm snuffing one of the guests. I Let's go. Our next course is called Man's Folly. Oh! oh. 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 I'm sorry. To our male diners, we now offer you the chance to escape. You'll be given a 45 second head start. At which point, members of my staff will try and catch you. If they do catch... Okay. 45 seconds starts now. Hold it. What? Sorry. Come on, you know I'm wonderful, awful. Wonderful critic. I'll, I'll send for help first thing. <laughs> you know he get caught. Go. When I tell y'all, when I tell y'all, first of all, 45 second head start, when I tell y'all, when I tell y'all, <laughs> 45 seconds is all I need. I'm finding the nearest ocean and I'm swimming far, far away. I'd rather survive out in the water than deal with that crap. Ain't no way. Ain't no way. Or I'm hiding in a tree. Like, you're not about to get me, bro. You're not getting me. <laughs> like, and if you do so-called catch me, we're fighting to the death. We're fighting. We're fighting. Like, I'm fighting all y'all. <laughs> like, fighting everybody who try to come and try to catch me. I'm getting all y'all. I'm... <laughs> it couldn't be me. I'm sorry. It could not be me in this movie. I have too many... No. It says I got your attention. Y'all comment down below what y'all do in, in this type of situation. What would y'all do? You know what I'm saying? It's not about me all the time. What would y'all do in this situation? I'm very curious to know. Go ahead. Comment down below. The heck is that? Y'all eating it. Oh, my God. This is fantastic. The tartness... The umeboshi and the, the waves of ferment, it's, it's rich and yet it's clean. It's delicious. Yes, well, there was a time that would have meant a lot to me, Miss Bloom. Mmm. It's, it's mm. so good. It's really good. Mm -hmm. You know, it's... It's the emoji for me. Umaboshi. Hmm? Umaboshi. Umaboshi. This is so good. <laughs> You're very talented. I can't, I can't, I cannot do this. I can't do this. First of all, she tore that up. Second of all, y'all. <laughs> y'all, they sitting around here eating this food. I want to stab somebody. I'm stabbing somebody, y'all. I'm sorry. I'm stabbing somebody 
I don't care if it's one of the staff or one of these ladies sitting at the table. I'm stabbing somebody. Y'all about to kick. What am I watching? You know what? Let's, let's go. So? Forget a boat. I'm swimming. It might be cold, but I'd rather be cold husband. than dead. <laughs> Yeah, he done. Are we all really dying tonight? It doesn't work if you live. No, what doesn't work? The menu. Why not? It needs an ending that ties everything together conceptually. Otherwise, it just tastes good and who cares? I mean, really, you should have your own place, right? Mm -hmm. And I could help you with that. I'm sure you could, Miss Bloom. I could, I could. We, we would just have to talk about the, the you know, the... <laughs> the, the dying thing. Oh, everyone dying was my pitch, actually. Super proud of it. <laughs> so what you're telling me right now is you and you only are the reason that everybody's about to die. You sitting here right 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 now at this table. You are the reason why everybody's about to die. Do you guys understand why I was just stab somebody at this point? You're the reason we're all about to die. You made the pitch. Oh, I'm so super proud of it. Your food sucks. I'm stabbing you in the throat. I'm not doing this, bro. I'm not. Let's go. Right. Right. <laughs> right. Because, like, I'm about to stab somebody. I heard a pop. Yeah. Took too long. I would have got in the water and swam. I'm swimming. A special bite for the last guest to be caught. A little play on the passage egg with creme fraiche and maple. <laughs> Bro, I cannot. I cannot. Homeboy really, homeboy really thought he was doing something with hiding with them chickens. A last meal for somebody. <laughs> A last meal for the last guest to get caught. Bro. Bro. Oh, God. <laughs> Oh my god. Oh, that was literal tears coming down my face. He really thought he ate. <laughs> he really thought he ate. Bro, couldn't be me. I'm sorry. Sir, <laughs> let's go. <laughs> yeah, just, just eat it. You might as well. My name is not Margo. It's Aaron, and I'm from Brockton, Massachusetts, so. There's that. How'd you do out there? I did great. I killed it. I'm the only one who got away. I'm sorry, I'm a fucking failure. It's okay. I've been stealing money from you. I know. Now I know. I know you know. At this point, <laughs> I know you see seed me on it. Folks, what is I'm happening? Our menu cannot continue as planned. 
Until we deal with an unresolved matter. You. Mm -hmm. Tell me why you're here. Well, because I wanted to swallow first. Mm -hmm. I wanted to experience your food, Chef. And what were you told? What, uh, what were you told ahead of time? You told me it would be the greatest menu ever created. Right, and? 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 That everyone would die. Everyone would die. You had a date. I seem to remember you had a date. Not the young woman here tonight. So what happened to her? Your date? She broke up with me, Chef. So you brought Margot? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Why? Uh, it's just because you don't offer scenes for one. So you hired her knowing she died. Yes. Now I know doggone well she's about to slap the, the heck out of him before I, when I hit this play button. You knew? You knew we were coming here to die. And you didn't say a cotton picking thing? You knew? I'm killing him? Y'all, I'm killing everybody. I don't care who you are at this point. Everybody's lying. Everybody's terrible. Everybody getting stabbed. Everybody getting stabbed. I don't care who you are at this point. It's every man for himself at this point. I'm killing the chef. I'm killing the staff members. I'm killing this stupid piece of crap that bought me here to die. And he knew he was. I'm killing everybody. Because ain't no way a friend invite me out to eat somewhere. That I can care less about going to. And I'm post and I'm about to die. Number one. Stay home y'all. Uber eats. Uber eats your food. It's not that deep. I am not trying to go to no restaurant over this. <laughs> It's not that deep. I can care less. Number two, check the people that you're surrounded by. <laughs> check your little friend group. Make sure you don't got no fakes in there or people that lie to you. Because what the freak? You knew? Let's go. Yeah. yeah. I, I knew that was going to happen. I was, I, was <laughs> I was waiting for it. Okay, I'm sorry. I just had to see that part. Go ahead. Yeah. Get your hand on me. I'll punch you in the face. Can't blame her. Uh -uh. What the uh -uh. fuck, Jet is? Uh -uh. Uh -uh. You, uh -uh. you knew what the yeah. problem uh -uh. was. What are they doing in the back? Ah, nice. You look wonderful. Doesn't he look wonderful, Margot? Doesn't he look good? Yes, sir. You're a cook. Oh, I'm so I cook. Can cook. Here, cook. cook. Now, cook. I don't. Cook. Go on now. What do you need? We have everything. Please don't rise be to observe the demonstration. Um. Please rise to observe uh, everyone, the demonstration. Please come around, please. Uh, I think it's done, Chef. You think it's done? You sure? Mm-hmm. You maybe you want to jam it into the Paco Jet. No. Mmm. Wow. Wow. It's actually quite... Bad. <laughs> you are why the mystery has been drained from our art. It's actually quite see that now, don't bad. You? There's only one more savory course left in our menu. That means we must prepare for dessert. Dessert requires a large barrel that is supposed to be there in the corner. <laughs> do you see a barrel? No, no, I do not. Neither do I. That is because my negligent colleague, Elsa, forgot to assign someone to bring it. So, 
Margot, you will fetch the barrel instead. I mean, I can't feel bad. <laughs> Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Who out there? Sir, Mr. Slowick. Um Hi. What's up? Hi, what's up? Do you wanna know why you're being punished? I saw the film calling Dr. Sunshine. I did not enjoy it. Sorry? <clears throat> it was a Sunday. My one day off in months. The most precious day, the day where I was allowed to live, and I saw the film calling Dr. Sunshine alone in the cinema. But, look, I, I, I didn't direct it, I just acted in it. The memory of your face in that film, and seeing you again now, haunts me. About well, freaking time you got a weapon. Oh Lord, oh Lord. No one is allowed inside Chef's house. Do you think you're special? Why would you die for him? He will not replace me. Replace you? Uh, trust me, I have no... <laughs> oh! Oh! Ah! Ray, knock her out! I didn't forget. What am I watching, bro? Like, what? <laughs> he did tell me about the barrels. That's why you're going out there with a knife? What the freak am I watching, bro? <laughs> Y'all, this, this movie is twisted in so many ways. <laughs> what the heck? Let's go. Take the knife. Take the knife. Take the knife. Take the nut. Your only weapon, and you leave it in her neck. You better. She dead. Wipe that sucker clean, ish. And we about to go stab some people. I'm, y'all, y'all. It could not be me. I'm getting all the weapons. I'm in this man's house. I'm killing. I'm, bro. <laughs> Y'all, let's go. The heck is in there? Where's the exit? I, that's what I want to know. How the heck he get out of here? What is in there that's so special? Where is the exit? no longer be hurt, Margo. As Dr. King said, we know through painful experience uh, that freedom is never voluntarily given. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. Don't you dare bring Dr. King to this. <laughs> Dr. King has nothing to do with any of this. My boy brought up Jesus earlier. Nah, we're not doing that. We're not doing none of that today. I'm sorry. We're, we're done with that. <laughs> like, y'all... Y'all gotta help me. I... Y'all wanna know something? Y'all wanna know something funny? Guess what time it is. 11.46 at night. It's supposed to be 12 in the morning. What the heck am I watching? All right? <laughs> okay. Did he just quote Martin Luther King? He sure did. He sure did. I see you found our radio. Clear the dining room immediately. You'll be tempted to ask him for help. To plead even, this would be unwise. He cannot help you. Ask yourselves two things. One, if you really want to be responsible for the death of an innocent man. And two, ask yourselves this entire evening, why didn't you all try harder to fight back, to get out of here? 
Honestly, you probably could have. I'm glad he said it because I would have been the number one person trying the hardest to fight to get the freak out of here. I would have been stabbing everybody. Everybody's getting stabbed. Everybody's getting stabbed. I would have been the only one fighting so hard. When those, when when the boys had a chance to run, that would have been my time. That would have been my time to go in. I'm scrapping with y'all. We fighting to the death. You ain't about to take me back to this place. And I'm outside. And like I, I got a boat <laughs> in my hand. And I'm getting out in the water. About to get away. And you're about to pull me. We're fighting. We're fighting to the death. To the death. One of us going to go. And I'm sure as heck going to make sure it ain't me. <laughs> y'all. He just said it. Y'all could have easily fought back. I would have fought back. Let's go. Good evening, officer. How can we help you? I got a report of disturbance. Uh, here? <laughs> what kind of a disturbance? A violent one. Are you the owner? I'm the executive chef. Ownership changed hands recently, but that's another story. Now, I don't wish to be rude, but as you can see, we're, we're right in the middle of service. Hey, uh, are you... Yes, 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 I, I am. Oh, wow. I, I'm a big fan. Okay. Thank you. Would you like this autograph? Uh, I don't want to bother you. Oh, no, 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 no. It, 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 it wouldn't be a bother. I just, I don't, I don't have a... No, we have a pen. We, let's do it. My wife and I, we love that, um, oh, what's it called? The one where uh, you play the surgeon. Yeah. Call him Dr. Sunshine. Yeah. Yeah. Great stuff. Here you go. Thank you so much. Too late. Hands on your head. Oh! Everyone, now. No, no, no. You're, you're joking. You're joking. I am not joking, sir. Oh, come on. Clearly, there's, there's a misunderstanding. Help us. Yes, yes you're hey, 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 no, 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 no
I'm blacking out and I'm stabbing everybody in my in my freaking way. In my course, in my arm length, everybody's getting stabbed. If either either all of us can attack at once and start just stabbing folks or snapping necks or fighting. Or I'm I'm killing everybody until somebody kills me. Because we're not about to do this. We're not about to do this, y'all. Going out like this. We're not doing this, bro. We're not. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. It's not happening. It's not happening. All this extras. No. 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 <laughs> let's go. Let's finish this. I don't like your food. What did you say? I said, I don't like your food, and I would like to send it back. What about my food is not to your liking? Every dish you serve tonight has been some intellectual exercise rather than something you want to sit and enjoy. When I eat your food, it tastes like it was made with no love. Oh, this is ridiculous. We always cook with love, don't we? No, sir! Everyone knows love is the most important ingredient. Then you're kidding yourself. You're a chef. Your single purpose on this earth is to serve people food that they might actually like, and you have failed. You failed, and you've bored me. And the worst part is, I'm still fucking hungry. What are you hungry for? What do you have? Everything. You know what I'd really like? Tell me. A cheeseburger. How do you like it? Medium. American cheese. American cheese is the best cheese for a cheeseburger because it melts without splitting. How much will that set me back? $9.95. Maybe she's on to some. Uh, it was a cheeseburger. Unfortunately, I think my eyes were a little bigger than my stomach. Can I get the rest to go? One moment, please. One cheeseburger to go. And a gift bag. Thank you for dining at Hawthorne. Before our final course, there is the matter of the bill. We're on a, a no-tip system, so gratuity is included. And please enjoy your gift bags. Um, some goodies in there. So once again, thank you for dining with us tonight. You represent the ruin of my art and my life. And now you get to be part of it. Part of what I hope is my masterpiece. And now our final dessert course is a playful twist on the comfort food classic. The s'more. We must embrace the flame. We the must be cleansed. What the heck is going Make on? Yeah, she's like, I'm done. We can be subsumed and made anew. Thank you. Y'all don't sock him with a chair? I love you all. We love you!